This lesson I'm about to go over is a lesson on how to do division one digit into three digits. Quick review. You all know how to do division with two digits into one into two. One digit into two digits. Let's do an example like this. So we have $13. We want to divide it equally amongst two people. How do we do this? Well, if each person gets one dollar, then we would use two of our dollars. If each person gets three dollars, then we would use six of our dollars. If each person would use seven dollars, then we'd use 14 of our dollars. We don't have 14 dollars. So each person must use, get six of the dollars. So 2 goes into 13, we have 6 times, and we've actually used $12 of the 13. We have $1 left. That's exactly how you do it. Nice and straightforward and simple. When we go 3 digits, let's take a number like 3 into 1, 3, 9, we do exactly the same thing. We're just going to bring in our shutter here and open our shutter up and just get rid of that 9. Now we go 3 goes into 13 how many times? Well, 3 times 3 is 9, 3 times 4 is 12, 3 times 4 that's 9, <laughs> that's 12, and that's 3 times 5 is 15. That's too many, so it's got to be 4. So 3 goes into that 4 times. We have 12, and that gives us one remainder. Now this is all we do now is we open up our screen to look at our next number. 9. We have a 1 in the tens column, we had 9 in the units column, we simply bring that 9 down, and now we have 19. New question, how many times does 3 go into 19? Well, when we look at this list here, 3 times 6 is 18, so 3 must go into 19 6 times. 3 times 6 is 18, we have 1 left over. And there's your answer. The answer is 46 remainder 1. That's it. It's that simple.